Welcome, it's Facts You Don't Know. If it's your first time here and you want to find out new facts that will definitely make you smarter and more. Well, and for make sure to subscribe and active the notification bell so you don't miss anything. A 15-year-old girl was arrested and charged with child abandonment and attempted murder after burying her newborn in order to keep her pregnancy a secret from her family. A police interrogator at the Chum Flang Police Station, Police Lieutenant Colonel Panawat Pudakam, told reporters on Friday that even though the girl was under the age of majority, the police were required by law to prosecute her and that she would be interrogated in the presence of child welfare workers. A psychologist and her parents have taken on the responsibility of caring for this young child, who's in great fear. She expressed regret for what she had done and admitted that she acted on impulse rather than thinking things through. She was worried that her parents would find out she was pregnant, the officer explained. The infant boy was saved because a farmer had noticed him while herding cows and brought him to the hospital. I went to a cassava plantation after hearing a dog howling and a baby screaming and found them to be true. The dog was digging up a dirt pile when the baby's legs came out. Usa Nisiaka, a 41-year-old farmer, explained, referring to a plantation about a kilometer from the village. The dog was digging up a dirt pile when the baby's legs came out. He and other members of the community transported the infant to Chumfuang Hospital, where he was cleaned up and deemed fit to be raised. According to Police Lieutenant Colonel Punawat, the baby survived because he was buried in a shallow grave. The district chief of Chumfuang stated that the girl did not intend to kill her, but rather did so out of terror, and that her parents elected to raise him. He enlisted the help of social workers in the area to look after the teen mother. The police were able to identify the girl because she'd purchased an abnormally large amount of sanitary napkins at the time of the incident, according to the report. In Thailand, a handicapped dog dug up a newborn baby who had been buried alive by its teenage mother and brought it to safety. Ping Bong, a six-year-old terrier, barked and dug at the earth until he exposed the child's thighs and legs. When the baby was discovered, it was rescued and taken to hospital, where it was determined to be healthy. Ping Pong is a wonderful young dog. In Thailand, the three-legged dog rescued a baby that had been buried alive by its teenage mother and brought it to safety. According to The Guardian, the six-year-old boy named Ping Pong sniffed, barked, and dug at the earth in Bang Nong Kam Hamlet in Shamfuang District, which is located northeast of Bangkok, until he uncovered the child's legs. Usa Nisiaka, the dog's 41-year-old owner, told local media that he went to check on the dog after hearing barking and a baby screaming in a cassava plantation. According to him, the dog was digging up a dirt pile when the baby's legs came to the surface. According to the Independent, the 5.2-pound newborn was hauled to safety and transferred to a nearby hospital where it was determined to be healthy. According to The Guardian, an unnamed 15-year-old girl confessed to burying her baby because she was afraid of notifying her father that she was pregnant because she felt embarrassed. According to reports, her family intended to care for the child. Shamfuang Police Lieutenant Colonel Punawat Pudakam stated that the girl is now under the care of a psychologist and her parents because she's in tremendous fear of what's happening to her. She expressed regret for what she had done and admitted that she acted on impulse rather than thinking things through. She was worried that her parents would find out she was pregnant. A second statement from the governor of the province stated that police officers are ready to prosecute the mother, but she's also a child, and we must regard her state of mind and be professional. It's critical that she's cared for and treated with respect. Ping Pong was hit by a car, and as a result, he's crippled, Nisiaka, who's fostered Ping Pong since infancy, explained. Nonetheless, I decided to keep him because he's extremely loyal and faithful, and he constantly lends a hand while I'm in the fields tending to my cattle. He's well-liked throughout the entire hamlet. It's incredible that he tracked down the infant. It's a great thing that a dog saved a human baby, right? But here are more to check. The stories of humans jumping in to save animals are commonplace, whether it's rescuing a puppy stranded in traffic or even going into a shark's mouth to remove hooked fish. We're able to recognize when an animal is in distress of struggling, and we feel a strong urge to assist them. Non-human animals are also capable of displaying such behaviors. Occasionally, these creatures help each other, such as this adorable piglet, who stepped in to assist his feline pale during a difficult period. And sometimes these animals help humans. This collection of 10 stories recounts instances in which animals exhibited compassionate and helpful conduct towards humans. Whale protects scientist from shark. 
She had no idea what to make of it when the humpback whale began pushing and leading scientist Nan Hauser in the water, and she was taken aback. At first she was terrified and perplexed, but then she understood that the whale had detected something she had missed, a gigantic tiger shark swimming close, which she had missed. Nan realized that the whale was attempting to protect her and guide her back to the boat when she saw the shark. Nan, who has dedicated her life to the protection of whales, had never witnessed anything like that before. But she was aware that whales sometimes exhibited similar behavior when protecting seals from killer whales, which she'd heard about. Despite the fact that she does not know exactly what's going on in the thoughts of these whales, she's aware of their altruistic desire to assist animals of other species. Dolphin Protects Man from Shark This story, like the previous one, is about an aquatic animal defending a person from a probable shark attack on the horizon. Adam Walker, a long-distance swimmer, found himself surrounded by a pod of dolphins after a great white shark surfaced in the water beneath him. Until the shark was no longer in the area, Adam and his companions swam alongside him. Adam happened to be swimming to collect money for the whale and dolphin conservation nonprofit organization at the time of the occurrence. It appears that he chose the correct cause. In 2004, a similar incident occurred. Gorilla Binti Joa Saves a Young Boy when a young child was visiting the Brookfield Zoo with his family in 1996, he slipped and fell into the gorilla area underneath him. While witnesses looked on in horror, Binti Jua, a western lowland gorilla, walked over to the injured youngster, grabbed him into her arms, and held him until emergency personnel came. The remarkable thing was that Binti Jua appeared to be acting out of a genuine desire to help this hurting child. In addition to showing what a nice and sensitive gorillas can be, the story highlights how unethical zoos can be through incidents such as these. It's been two decades since Binti Joa's story touched the hearts of Americans. A similar circumstance occurred at the Cincinnati Zoo this year, but it did not have a pleasant ending, tragically. An eight-year-old child was injured after falling into the gorilla habitat at the Cincinnati Zoo, where Harambe, a silverback gorilla, was living at the time. In order to properly recover the boy, Harambe was unfortunately slain because his response appeared to be more hostile than usual. Circumstances such as this demonstrate that zoos place animals and visitors in unneeded and dangerous situations to attract visitors. Sasha the Pitbull Saves Family from Fire A fire came out in the apartment of this California household, and Sasha, the little pitbull, notified them by barking incessantly until the mother of the house, Nana Chai, woke up. Not only that, but Sasha assisted in the rescue of Nana Chai's baby by lifting her from the bed. In addition to Sasha, Baby, a 10-year-old pit dog, exhibited heroism by saving his family from a fire on two separate occasions. In the modern era, pit bulls are typically characterized as violent, but traditionally they've been referred to as nanny dogs because of their kindness when it comes to children. A pit bull's loyalty and bravery are demonstrated by dogs such as Sasha and Baby. Sea Lion Saves Man After He Jumped from the Golden Gate Bridge Kevin Hines, who was only 19 years old at the time, attempted suicide by jumping from the Golden Gate Bridge in San Francisco, citing mental illness as his motivation. He somehow survived the hit, but he sustained significant injuries and was desperately attempting to keep afloat in the frigid waters. After feeling a thing in the water and becoming alarmed, he understood that it was an animal rubbing up against him and assisting him in swimming. Even though he was unaware of the animal that saved him at the time, he later discovered that the animal in question was a sea lion thanks to photographs taken by spectators. Kevin Hines is now on a mission to teach people all across the world about mental health and suicide prevention. Pride of Lions Saved Kidnapped Girl Lions are well known for being both majestic and ferocious hunters, and this is no exception. These animals, on the other hand, proved to be lifesavers for a 12-year-old Ethiopian girl who was kidnapped by a group of four masked males. The kidnappers were on the run with the police on their tails, but their intentions were foiled when they came face to face with a group of lions who scared them away. After that, the lions stayed with the small girl until the police officers came on the scene. Several police officers have stated that they stood guard until they were able to locate her, and then they simply left her like a present and disappeared back into the jungle. It's believed by some experts that the girl's calls for aid sounded like the sounds of an immature lion cub, which caused the lions to be sympathetic to her plight. Thanks for watching. Please like and share the video in social networks. We'll be right back to you as fast as we can.